This is Dr. Gerald Cost from the Point of Care Testing Center for Teaching and Research at the University of California, Davis. Our research, funded by a Fulbright Scholar Award, was accepted for publication by Public Health and Surveillance. We looked at COVID during the peak of the spread of the disease in Cambodia and focused on diagnostic solutions near the borders on both sides of the country, but principally in a province that had a high rate of communication of the disease due to people crossing the border. So you might say we developed techniques for dealing with diagnosis both by rapid antigen test and PCR in the border province areas. As the founding father of the field of point of care testing, which is defined as testing at or near the site of patient care, in this study of Cambodia and its response to the COVID crisis, we wanted to publish in a JMR our journal because we wanted to reach out to and educate and make public health professionals aware. Additionally, the Fulbright study was sponsored by the National Institute of Public Health in Phnom Penh and the National Public Health Laboratory. So the FIT was quite well integrating pathology, clinical diagnostics, and public health. Our experience with the JMIR submission process was adequate and satisfactory. And furthermore, we believe that this journal will help us achieve our goal of reaching out to public health professionals to learn more about diagnostics, specifically PCR and rapid antigen tests in its application to limiting epidemic spread. Of course, there could be another pandemic. We have to do a little better next time. To understand the details, please refer to my series of papers on the mathematics. That's mathematics of testing in the context of a prevalence of disease. They've been published in several different journals. You'll find them on PubMed or by using a Google tool. In short, we're satisfied with what happened. And further, we feel that video communication, such as the one you're watching now, will help us to achieve our goal of crossing the bridge from diagnostics to public health, and in particular to the community where the testing needs to be made available. Thank you for your time.